just by our motor camp we were looking over the fence to this sculpture here uh, three dimensional as you move around the face continues to look at it so I tried to record it this morning on the video and uh, this is the result can you see how the face follows you as you walk around So it's 9 o'clock on uh, Tuesday morning. The what date is it? Gale the 19th, I think. Today? Eh? 19th today. The 19th, yeah. We're leaving Oslo now and uh, heading back to Sweden momentarily. Gonna have a night in Sweden and then cross back to Denmark. So we're uh, just. Scandinavia. We've given the van its ablutions, it's emptied its um, tanks, and we've topped up the fresh water tank. And uh, Trev's just scurrying back over here to the office to uh, put the keys in. So they're swipe keys that get you in and out of the gate here. So that's that side of the story. Anything else you want to add to that? No. Well, um, I think Oslo improved over the days as we got to know the city. We, we got to appreciate it's below its ugly surface. Yeah, I in particularly enjoyed that big park with that uh, massive statue of the progression of age of uh, progression of man. Yeah. I think probably the people were my highlight. The the lovely, helpful people. The young people in the shops were just so helpful. Just very, very pleasant. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, absolutely. And I think that it's the people that make the city. Um, that. Um, man from northern Norway in a cafe and getting a referral to writers, Norwegian writers, bookshops. Good. Now my navigator's back. Trevor, what was your highlight? Highlight of staying here? Of Oslo. Um, I think getting out to the Viking Museum was pretty special. Yeah. Seeing those ships and, and um, yeah how they were constructed and that technology for bloody how many years ago was that Trev that was a thousand years ago we'll give it yeah, away yeah absolutely it's stunning that so like they, they they knew that before those dates didn't yeah. they when you look at the technology behind the America's Cup challenges and that now and then you look at the technology those guys had they were right up there tell you what I'm pleased they're not here today going in the America's Cup we wouldn't won, we, we wouldn't get near them eh? <laughs> Enjoy about that. You, you, uh, oh, the ship biking ships. Yeah, biking ships. And it was just neat getting around the waterfront and seeing the tall ships, getting up into the old fort and having a look around there. And yeah, yeah. Me, me, and all the shop assistants. I'll tell you what, they were absolutely wonderful. Yeah. And um, and then, talking to one of them, and uh, only young person, young woman, and she said, "Our yeah, Sweden and Norway don't really like one another." And oh. I found that quite. A, Astounding, actually. So and I said, "Would that be like on the sports field, like we are with Australia?" And she says, "Oh no, no, it's deeper than that." Yeah. So you know, some historical thing there, maybe. Mm. Yeah. So it's going in, Trev. Going in. She so we're just coming down from Oslo, we're halfway down to where we're heading to tonight and have a cup of tea here on the side of the road. Uh, then we're going out to a small fishing type village there for the night. So this is the wheat crop, Shit, the milks are not up yet. Hey, I'm Tim. Tim, pleased hey. to meet you. I'm Kerstin. Kerstin, good on you. Thank you. So, we're here in, uh, which country are we in? Uh, we're in 
Norway. Norway, Norway yeah. yes, yeah. Yeah, the yeah. bottle just made. I'll just check with this one here. Yeah, that's all in order. Now we're away, yeah. So you, you, you're traveling right through Norway with this one? Uh, no, a little bit because we started in Malmö, in oh, yes. the south of Sweden. Yes. Uh, we come by ferry from Germany. Yes. And uh, now our destination is Oslo. Yes, lovely. And from there we go back to Denmark by ferry. Yes. And cycle along uh, Denmark to back to Germany. Good. So your muscles will be getting stronger now coming <laughs> yeah, this distance. Yeah, at the moment, yeah. We, this is one and a half week. We are now yeah, on the bike. Right, good. We started uh, Sunday last week. Lovely. Yeah. yeah. So, two of you is on the bike. One that's like a tandem. Can you show me around it? Yeah, yeah, of course. Yeah, you're it's on. It's a special kind of tandem because it's a lying seat in the front. Yes. And I have the handlebar, the brake, and the gears in the back. Yes. And it is much more comfortable for Kerstin in the front because yes, it would be. uh, it's, it's not so easy to, to sit down on the saddle all day. No. And and so it's it's better, and we we can travel longer distance uh, per day. This was what we needed for tanding because yes. it's tanned sleeping bags and yeah. all the other things. Good work, uh, yeah. Normally we, we sleep in our tent because the last night it was very rainy yes, and yeah. so we, we hired a little hut in oh, the yes, cabin. Yeah. It was much easier yeah. because it was dry. <laughs> and your clothes either side, your, your wet weather gear or your other non-biking clothes? Huh? That's our closest um, Tim's and mine. Yes. And that's the rain gear in and um, little stuff, uh, technical equipment and yes. uh, the cooking gear on the other side. Oh good. Uh, this is Trevor. Hi, how are you? Hi. How are you? Hi. Yeah. Nice to meet you. And if you ever get to New Zealand, then you come and stay ah, yeah. with us. We, 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 we stay in New Zealand uh, oh, three, thank you three, very much. Three, three years ago. I three years so, yeah. ago, yes. Mm -hmm. We cycled on the North Island. Mm -hmm. Oh yes, we're in the South Island. Uh, Okay, you're oh, oh. <laughs>